Hi everyone, so today I'm heading out towards the Congo River, which is in Diani. It's not the big Congo River, second biggest uh, river in the world. No, it's not the Congo River, I'm afraid, in Congo. It's actually a small river, I think it's about 4.7 kilometers long. It's in Diani, uh, on the Diani Road, a uh, barrier between Diani and Mombasa, basically. And uh, yeah, I'm going to check this place out, see what it has to offer, and uh, let you know as I progress. Watch this space. Today I'm heading for the Congo River estuary. This is where the Congo River flows into the Indian Ocean. It's also about as far as you can go on the Diani Road um, because the Congo River is the dividing line between Diani Beach and Tiwi. Uh, there is also a really old Kenyan mosque here that dates back to the 16th century. Unfortunately I won't be able to film there today because it is a very special prayer day and there will be people there worshipping so yeah unfortunately I won't be able to film there today but if you do go to uh, Congo River Estuary it's well worth checking out this old mosque. Um, I'll also be visiting a little restaurant, a little beach restaurant called Congo Sands Restaurant, checking out some food there and as always giving you my unbiased review at the end. And so I arrive at the Congo River. This is the entrance to the beach. This is where the river folds into the sea, flows into the sea, call it what you like. But this is the Congo River. And somewhere around here, we have a very old mosque. It's supposed to be thousands of years old. this absolutely fantastic white sand, blue water, I mean it's just paradise within its own right. We're heading towards the beach. This is where they're going to be holding the um, Red Bull Safari. And as you can see, in the distance, we've got the Congo River. So this is where the river meets the sea, the Congo River. It's only 4.7 miles long, apparently. I could be wrong. Don't kill me if I am. Look at the fantastic baobabs on the side there. These trees live hundreds of years absolutely amazing. Some tribes believe that God actually planted them upside down because he was angry. The Congo River meets Diani Beach. And this is I guess what you call an estuary where the Congo River goes in to the sea. There's the Congo River in Diani, not to be mistaken for the big Congo River, um, second biggest in the world, to the Nile of course. You can actually get a boat 
the Congo River. It'll take you all the way through it, up and down, 4.7 kilometers of it. Again, I wouldn't advise walking around here at night, but during the day, perfectly safe, to the best of my knowledge. So there you have it, the Congo River. If you want to grab a boat, take a slow ride, they are also available. I don't know how much they charge, probably around 500 shillings, which is about £3.50. What a fantastic little spot, so beautiful. This is the Congo River, uh, not, not the big Congo River in Congo, but small Congo River in uh, Diani. And yeah, it's where the Congo River meets the ocean. As you can see in the background, that's Diani Beach in the background. And further up, you have uh, Ukunda and Kwale and all the other places that this river passes through. So we've got a little seafood shack here on the Congo River. I'm gonna grab something to eat and uh, yeah see what it's like. So here I am at the Congo River restaurant. Um, I've just ordered myself some fish called taffy. That's the Swahili name for it. I'll find out what the English name for it is. But yeah, taffy and some chips uh, come out to 500 shillings altogether, which is about £3.50. So my fish has arrived. It's, uh, call it taffy fish I don't know what it's called in English I'm gonna about to find out it's a sea fish it's a taffy fish with some chips and a little bit of onion as I say proof of the pudding isn't it tasty mm, a bit dry I think it's big cooked and reheated but, you know, it is what it is a little bit of white flesh restaurant at the Congo River in Diani. Well, to be honest with you, when I first tasted that fish, I wasn't too sure. But when I finished, I got into it and finished eating it, I'll tell you what, it's called taffy. I don't know what the English name for that fish is. I will find out and leave it in the um, title below. Uh, the information will be below as to what kind of fish that was. If you get a chance to taste taffy fish, I'll tell you what, it's one of the sweetest fish I've ever tasted. Absolutely gorgeous. Cooked to perfection. Uh, you know, 500 shillings, £3.50 that cost me, is with chips. Amazing. Totally recommend this place. Uh, fish is fresh, caught this morning. And yeah, taffy. As I say, leave comments below if you know what taffy fish is. Please help me out. Uh, but I'll try and find out and I'll probably Google it and leave it in the title below. So yeah, the Congo River restaurant uh, at the Congo River in Diani. Well worth a visit. Check this place out. I'm Kevin Harrington, Chef's Travels. Thanks very much for watching. Hopefully see you on the next one. Cheers.